I am Anil Kumar. Welcome to my series on test preparation. We are calling this special for SAT Math Level 2. All the questions which you will find in this playlist are amazing and they have been asked in so many test papers. So all of you will actually find them very useful. The question here is, three circles of equal radius are drawn tangent to each other as shown here in the diagram. An equilateral triangle is drawn to circumscribe the three circles. If the radius is R, so I've taken general radius, right? So if the radius is R of each circle, what is the perimeter of the triangle? We need to find the perimeter. That means sum of all these sides, right? So all sides are X. You need to add them up three times X which will give you the perimeter correct that's the question for you you can pause the video answer the question and then look into my suggestions the whole idea of giving a general value is that in the test this r could be two three whatever once you know the formula you can easily figure it out so so r and r we know this distance will be two r correct to find the length we need to find what is this distance and what is that from the symmetry we can work on one side so that's what we are going to do so important thing to remember here is that we are working with equilateral triangle correct so the angles are 60 degrees so if i'm looking at if i join the center of a circle in the corner with the center what do you expect this angle to be clearly this angle will be 30 degrees correct half of 60 total is 60 degrees correct so half of that from the symmetry is going to be 30 degrees and the side opposite to the angle is R and we need to find what is the base of this right so so we can use tan so we know that tan of 30 degrees is equal to R over B. So from here, we can get what this base is up to the first circle center. So base is equals to R over tan of 30 degrees. Do you see that? And how do you find tan of 30 degrees? Special triangle, perfect. So this special triangle, we you know one, two, square root three. And that is the angle which we're talking about. Tan is 1 over square root 3. So you could write this as R times square root 3. So this side B and this side B is R times square root 3. Correct? This is also R times square root 3. So we get the value of X as equals to R times square root 3 plus center to center is 2 times R plus R times square root 3. Perfect. So that becomes one value of x. So now, when we know the value of x, we'll multiply this by 3 to get our answer. So the value of x for us is r plus r, 2r square root 3, right, plus 2r. So now, 3x will be how much? Multiply this by 3. So we get 6r square root 3 plus 6r taking 6 as common also r as common we get square root of 3 plus 1 and that is the answer for us a is that clear to you so that is how you're going to answer all these questions now i'll provide you a link where we have a billiards table and you know there are 10 balls within this queue uh, so that is another very good question from test point of view so these are very popular questions i like you to go through this playlist and solve each and every question and if you kind of get a glimpse of these formulas you don't really have to remember them but you you know if you have the figure in your mind and this connection in your test it takes less than a minute to solve this and that is where it becomes crucial so i hope you're finding my videos useful and beneficial share them with your friends and if you like and subscribe that'd be great thanks for your time and all the best